After my accident, when I lost my leg and I realized that I needed to start to develop my own prosthetic leg to get me back to the level of competition that I wanted to be in, I knew that the Fox Shock was the right package for the job because of the lightweight and highly adjustable features of it. I was talking with Ricky Strobel up in Baxter, Minnesota, and he offered to help me out with anything I needed. So I took him up on that offer and he let me use some of the tooling in his shop and his team kind of helped me out with the lathe in the mill to get everything started. And it's just evolved from there. The loss of his leg was the beginning of a new chapter in Mike's life. With a prototype leg and a new team forming around him, Mike started to climb back to the podium in adaptive motocross. It was just a short time ago, it's like you're thinking to yourself, man, I don't know what Mike's gonna do. You know, he's, how is he ever gonna recover from this? And now you're looking at him, he's riding, he's like, it didn't even slow him down a bit. It just inspired him to go harder and faster. And with us being a part of that, he just rides faster all the time. Motocross was just the beginning. When winter hit, Mike was back on a sled, winning snowcross events. And at the same time, looking ahead to other action sports to tackle. The physical demands of different sports vary on an athlete's body, which meant for Mike, it was now time to take his product development to a whole new level. Through data acquisition and other sophisticated sensors, Mike and the Fox team gathered key, real-world information. The data is then taken back to the lab for analysis and is used to recreate the rigors from the real world on dynos that, unlike the human body, never tire. Working closely with their partners and investing in state-of-the-art R&D equipment is only one part of the Fox formula. Back in the 70s, Bob Fox was a passionate motocross enthusiast, and the thing that he thought was holding him back was the suspension at the time. With his technical engineering background, he thought he could do better, and he did. The result of that were the first Fox Air Shocks. He proved that he came up with a better solution. Perhaps the most important thing Bob stumbled onto in those days was Fox's formula for success, which simply put, our enthusiast employees who have technical backgrounds, those two things coming together to create solutions. We get to take the products out, ride them, and take the information that we learn and apply that to back to our job. We go to the racetrack, we have some fun, we work with some athletes like Mike and some other guys that we will make them the best product out there because we live it every day. With a state-of-the-art machine shop in Scotts Valley, California, Fox is running their 45 CNC machines 24 hours a day, six days a week. Parts are routinely made with tight tolerances down to four decimal places, or plus or minus one ten thousandths of an inch. Their cellular manufacturing approach creates a globally competitive cost structure by allowing one machinist to run several machines. In every stage of production, we have checks and balances to ensure we're building to the high expectation of our customers. We're our own toughest customer. We're always striving to raise the bar for our customer and ourselves. The difference between good enough and optimal performance is less than the width of a single strand of hair. Maintaining tight tolerances is a top priority, no matter the source of the part. The quality control process is developed and perfected in the Fox facility in Watsonville, California. Every shipment goes through a thorough, tightly controlled inspection process. Bottom line is, good enough is not in the Fox vocabulary. We're headquartered in Scotts Valley, California, where some of the best mountain biking in the world is. Our base of manufacturing operations is in Watsonville, California. Our, our off-road truck division is, is located in San Diego, California, the heart and soul of that off-road community. We're in Baxter, Minnesota, where the side-by-side -side ATV and snowmobile scene is centered. And we have global operations in Bern, Switzerland, and Taichung, Taiwan. I'm pretty sure Bob never imagined this global reach company coming from his humble beginnings, which was actually his friend's garage. The cool thing about it is, is we have a partnership with our athletes to really understand what they need on the track to make them succeed. Fox is a huge part of my life. It's not just a sponsorship, it's more of a relationship. As an athlete, Fox is helping to redefine my limits on the racetrack. And through the development of the Moto Knee, it's 
redefining the limits of other amputees and the activities they really want to do. It's really all about continuous improvement because good is never good enough. And as Bob always says, we're never done.